Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss what is not functioning Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio. So, is not function is used to handle the null value in the table. So, it returns alternative value when an expression is null. So, let's see by one example. So, I am going to select EMP table. So, here after select 1000 rows. So, this is the query that generated and this is the record inside the table and here one column com so in com you can find null value here so sometimes what happens null value not looking good in the table so you can replace null value with some other value so let's uh, see the example so add here after the dpt number I'm going to use is null function. Is null function and here I'm going to pass condition column. So add here writing com and here open the value of com is null. So that point I'm going to replace null by zero. And uh, here, so this is the query. So let's execute here. So see at here, uh, this point null value. So here, a uh, one new column generated. So if you want here, you can uh, give the name also. So let's give first name. So write column alias as, and here give the name. So I'm going to write here. Coming sign. Now let's execute. So see at here, uh, one column added. So see uh, this point to null value. So null value that replaced by 0. Like this here, or uh, it's a null, so that replaced by 0. So when the value is not null, so at here, it's not doing anything. And here this point null, so it's replaced by 0. So this is the thing. So if you want to or replace by any other number, so let's skip one at here and execute. So see at here, null value this time replaced by one. Here replaced by one. So like this. So at here next, I'm going to make order by clause on DPT number. So DPT number is in order by. So see at here, dpt number 10, so add here, com. So this or 3, fill 3, that's all or null value. So null value, it's replaced by 1. And here, till this point, this all value, null. So it's replaced by 1. And here, some value, so it's not doing anything. And here after null, so that replaced by 1. So this is the use of null, is null function. So it return alternative value when expression is null. So this is the one example. Hereafter I am going to show you one new example. So at here, let's write select a statement. And here, after I am going to do aggregator or calculation. So aggregator, one function, sum is the aggregator function. So I am going to do sum. So if is null, so if a com value is null, so that adds the value with 100. And hereafter, I am going to use as and your com. And uh, here after uh, from escort dot so give the table name escort dot emp is my table name and here I'm going to make group by on dpt number so and here give the comma or dpt number. 
Now let's execute this query. So see right here. Oh, it's a 10, and here this is 320, 500, 30, 2, 4, So when you execute right here this query, so see right here 10 is three times, three times. So right here the query uses so sum is null. So when or that font count value is null, so that replaced by 100. So first time that get 100, next time that do the calculation 100, and here after again 100. So for one group 10 is, I'm making the group on DP number, so 10 is in one group. So at here, uh, 100 plus 100 plus 100, so the value comes 300. So at here I'm using some function, so some value that return 300. So that here I'm getting the output. 300. So for debit 10. So suppose add here, let's execute this query again. So next is debit 20. So 20 is uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10. So one by one that calculate is a function that found null. So that replaced by 100 and here after that to some calculation. So like this, that are five times. So that hundred plus hundred plus hundred five times five hundred. So that here it's so displaying five hundred. Now here after check or DPD thirty. So that make DPD thirty is in one group. So first is fourteen hundred. At here this point fourteen hundred. So that uh, not to anything here after hundred. So this is now fifteen hundred. That add. So suppose uh, 14 or uh, null value, calculate the first null value. So null value is now at here one time. So that 100 here after this is a two time. So this is the, this is now 200. And here after uh, 200, 5 plus 2, 7, 7 plus or 3, 1000, 1000 plus 1400. So for DPT, or 30 that return 2400. So write in DPT 2400. So when uh, is a function that check if commission value com is null. So if the com null, so that's the 800. And here after that do some calculation. So that means null is a function generally used to handle the null value. Uh, so if it return uh, if the condition is mass so it return alternative value so you can use any alternative value at home so 100 is the alternative value so you can include any number so and you can give 500,000 whatever you like so this is the things about personal function so I hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next Thank you.